Hi there folks, well, welcome back to my channel and for this video I am back in the East Lothians and I'm actually just on the edge of the village of East Linton. I've been to East Linton before but I've never been to where I'm going to just now because where I'm going to just now is called Preston Mill and Preston Mill is in the care of the National Trust for Scotland. We do have a wee page for Preston Mill on their website so I'll link that in so you can uh, get all information there see what's going on. Yes, so, yeah. If you want to find out more about Preston Mill, you can do so there. And today I was actually supposed to be going on a Waverley, going on a wee boat trip, like going down the water. But, like the weather over on the west coast, it was kind of quite stormy last night, quite wet. And it was still quite windy as well when I left. So it probably wasn't a good idea to be going on a wee boat trip. So they've cancelled that for today, so I have to try and rearrange that. So, but the weather on the east coast, where I am just now, uh, this is so much better, it's a lot brighter. And definitely not as windy. So, definitely going to be heading out in just a moment and taking you around to Preston Mill. And yeah, so, before I do head out, if you enjoy my channel, if you enjoy my videos, if you can click on the subscribe button, click on that notification bell, Leave some likes, leave some comments, it's always really appreciated. And if you'd like to support the channel further, I will post a link to the channel's coffee.com page, the channel's PayPal account and the TikTok account in the description bar below and in the pinned comment in the comment section. So with it out of the road, I'm going to grab my bag and head on out. This is where I am just now. So, quite a pretty location. I have an information board down here. That's uh, the prices and opening times. And they do have uh, information on different National Trust for Scotland sites you can visit throughout Scotland. And obviously the information board. Yeah, and it looks at the John Muir. Walk actually cuts through the, this area as well. Yeah, this is the exhibition space in one of the old mill buildings. So it's giving an idea of how the mill would work. And a lot of the history of the mill as well. About some of the tools. Yeah, they've actually got a lot of tours uh, around this place. It's uh, every hour, like on the half hour. But as again, I'm a bit tight for time because I'm actually home to be going to the Belhaven Brewery. So we visit there as well. So I'm just going to wander around and show you what's happening. But again, the fact that there is options of having a tour around this place is always good if you come for me to visit. I think you've got to come round this way to get into this building. Oh, it's a wee chicken coop. Yeah, it must be used for years, a pig style as well at some point. Mm -hmm. 
So I'll be cubby holes in I also have that set up as a to mimic it being a wee fireplace. Obviously for the the heating of the grain. I think if you actually want to have access to that to the inside the mill building, you've got to go on the tour. Let's see what I can see from in here. Yeah, so this is a, the little stream that's powering the mill. So they've got a wee lead, and it'll obviously open or close to control the water flow. And they've got the warm water wheel here. So it's time to leave the mill behind. And as we path here, it takes you over a wee footbridge. And that would take me over towards the, the ducket. So yeah, I think I think that's the path that uh, John John Muir Wake follows. So if you are doing the John Muir Way, you can stop off here at the at Preston Mill, have a little wander around uh, before you head off towards the bar or Helensborough, depending on which way you're going. But I'll turn the camera around and let you have a, a wee look at the meadow. Yeah, I forgot to say earlier on, if you're just wandering around by yourself, so not, obviously not going into the, the main building of the, the mill, and you're not going on one of the tours, you don't have to pay. But you, if you're wanting to go out and get a tour of the mill, and also get taken into the mill itself, that's what's, that's what's going to cost you £10. Pounds. Well, it's £10 pounds for an adult, and um, obviously it'd be different rates for my families, concessions and such like, but yeah, it's definitely a glorious day. Yeah, so if you are doing the drum your way, you're coming from the mill, you come from the East Linton, come across the bridge, and you go along that direction. That takes you along towards Dunbar. That's about six and a half miles away. But I'm heading this way, because where I'm heading to is down there. Yeah, and just over there, that's Trap Rain Law, which I have previously tried to climb. I'll have to get back, I have to try and get back there at some point, get to the summit of it. It's like quite, quite a distinctive profile, especially as it's, got, as it's got that big chunk taken at the side from when it was being used as a quarry. Yeah, so that's what I'm walking down to see. That's a dovecot or ducket. And for those who need to know, there is a train station in East Linton. <coughs> so 
obviously that's the nearest that'd be the nearest train station to here and you can actually walk it from East London train station to Preston Mill so that's the dovecote right there there's a wee information board don't think I'm going to be able to get in you know the door's locked There's a wee sign telling you in what direction to go down to for the mill. Just come around there, go up a wee bit further, get a, a clear view of a dovecot. What a lovely looking day in Scotland. Maybe not. It's quite a threatening cloud, so I had to make a wee quick getaway before the rain really came down. Well, that's my, me back at the car after my little visit to Preston Mill. Yeah, okay, was brought to a kind of bit of a quicker round than expected because of the rain. But yeah, I think I got back to the car just in time because it was really start to spit as I was crossing the bridge back taking me back over towards the mill but again that, that's part of, that's part of the joy of Scotland there's always that element of never being too too sure of the weather it just keeps you on your toes makes things interesting but I definitely enjoy my little visit here to Preston Mill it's a beautiful little place really tranquil really peaceful definitely definitely full of history and again I do have uh, tours of the mill itself uh, every hour on the half hour. So it's like, I think it's like half 10, half 11, half 12. I think it's up to about half four, half three or half four. But definitely come along and have, have a wee explore of the mill itself. And yeah, definitely a wee, a wee hidden gem here in, in East Lothians. So hopefully you will have enjoyed this video and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye bye.